everyone, my name is Varsha and in this video I'm going to show you how to create this beautiful flower goddess look. Um, honestly, this is like a brainchild of mine and it's pretty fun to see how well it came out. It took me longer than expected but honestly I am very happy with the way it looks. If you want to see how I created this beautiful look, continue watching. Hey everybody, um, for the first time I'm actually using a professional camera, so let's just see how this goes. Uh, so here's my plan. For the first, I guess, let's just say 45 minutes, I'm going to spend doing my base, uh, which is not that complicated, but I might have to glue one eyebrow down. And the next 45 minutes I'm going to spend actually doing the eyeshadow and the designs and stuff. I don't know how this is gonna turn out, so we'll just have to wait through the entire process and see. So um, I have finished moisturizing my skin, so that shouldn't be a problem. I'm gonna prime my skin, and while it sets, I will do my eyebrows. Now I'm gluing one of my eyebrow down. using powder to set it in place. In the meantime, I'm gonna do my eyebrow on this side and I'm gonna do my base. Let's go. As usual, I am starting with... Uh, I've always wanted to do that, that was so fun. Anyways, I'm just starting with a regular brush like this zero brush that people use for paints. Honestly, it's super precise and super thin. I'll end up with that. Time to conceal. actually tissues that I painted over with watercolors for the petals. 
I'm gonna take a piece of glue and I'm gonna put it on the sheet. And I'm gonna start attaching them one by one. lashes of glue for it which honestly is very strong so kind of scared to use them let's see I'm using a brush to apply the glue because honestly doing it with just a, a tongue is really difficult I need to use some other tool to apply the glue on top of my petal so I'm trying to create not just layers but also depth which is why I'm kind of placing them a little haphazard I'm gonna do the rest of this off camera. All right, so as you can see, I am done with just the upper portion of the flower. So what I'm gonna do right now is wait for this to dry. And while waiting, I'm gonna finish my eye on this side. I'm serious, I actually spent 15 minutes on this eye look only to remove it later. But regardless, I'm just gonna explain what I'm doing. I did my eyeshadow, I did like a base, and then I took a stronger color and went over it with like this really bright pink. And then I cut the crease, added some eyeliner, put some falsies, and right now I'm doing my freckles with red liner. Alright, so um, I actually changed my eyeshadow because I thought that it was too uh, dull. And I thought that eyeshadow made my eyes look small instead of big. And that's kind of like the opposite effect I wanted. So I changed it up. I added some freckles and now I'm going to take sap green and create like twines along my face. Bye.